Hello everyone! Today I have a huge heavy box from Tord. Tord is a sister company to Hot Topic. They sell all the plus size sizing clothes for Hot Topic. They also have their own brand. They share mainly their pop culture line. So Tord sent me, I think, the whole line for Outlander. We're gearing up for a season three of Outlander. This is book three, Voyager Come to Life. I've already seen the first episode, got to watch it at Comic Con. I'm like, keep it cool, collect myself. No crazy. So if you guys haven't watched Outlander yet or you haven't read the book, I highly recommend it. It's one of my favorites. I know a lot of you guys do watch Outlander, so if you haven't already bought the first collection from Outlander. I think there's still a few pieces left. I have the pea coat, I have the skirt, I have this which says Je Supri, and I also have Claire's writing jacket, whatever it was. I am about to go to Scotland in like a few weeks here. I'm so excited. Sasha and I are going to Scotland in an Outlander theme adventure. I want to wear these clothes. I'm hoping I can. I'm kind of scared to go to Scotland because I'm not the kind of person who likes like wet cold climate, but it's going to be an adventure and I'm gonna love it and I hope Hopefully I can wear some of these things there. I'm so excited. Okay. Sing me a song of a last that is gone. Say goodbye to us, the eye. This is very taped up. I'm wondering if he didn't want it falling out of the box. Do you guys remember when I opened up the Wonder Woman box from Warner Brothers and how disappointing that was, the huge box? This one feels a lot heavier than the Warner Brothers box. Oh. There's another box inside the box. And I have a note from Torrid. Here's a note from Torrid. It says, Natasha, we hope you love our new Outlander collection as much as we do. We can't wait to see you in these looks. Don't forget to check out season three premiere on September 10th. The hashtags for the Torrid Outlander collection is Outlander X Torrid and then hashtag Outlander. You should also follow the Torrid Fangirl Instagram. I got the chance to take over their Instagram back during San Diego Comic Con. If you ever wear anything from Torrid and it's like pop culture based, make sure to tag them and then they'll repost your pictures. Oh, 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 there's two boxes. Oh, oh, this is so exciting. This is so exciting. Look at this. Oh, it's just like Christmas. Okay, I gotta put this one down because look, see, there's another box. I am so grateful for this. This is the coolest thing ever. This is very heavy. Is it taped? Is that why it's not coming off? Hopefully don't break a nail doing this. Oh, first world problems. Ah. Oh, they're coats, they're coats, they're coats. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Holy crap, look at this beautiful coat. Oh my gosh, I want to put it on now. This is the inner lining of the coat. It looks to be the Fraser Tartan. The Fraser Tartan has red and yellow going through it. It's a navy blue coat. It, it looks exactly like Claire's coat. I don't know if she wears it in Boston or in the beginning of season one. And there's pockets. This fits perfectly. It's all nice and trim. It's so pretty. I love it. They have the outliner tags on the coat. The coat is originally $118. There are constant sales and deals on tour. So if you're not willing to pay that price, then just keep an eye on it and see like which pieces you love the most and which ones you want in your wardrobe. There's also Hot Cash that Tord uses and there's a Tord credit card. So there's all different options. And look, there's like three buttons right here. Next, we have another tartan coat. I think this is another like long duster. Oh, it's a little bit different. This is more like a wrap coat. You've got a wrap strap thing around the waist. It looks to be kind of like a waterfall hem. There's a snap right here. There's a button on the inside. The tartan is more, you can see it's more turquoise green color on the inside the Scottish thistle there it is I think I'm gonna like this one a lot too because I like that like wrap look oh also look at the arms so some pretty stuff for the fall guys so this is a size one I'm a size one in tour you may want to size up on this coat depending on like what things you want to wear underneath it it comes right under my butt and I got this pretty detail and then this is just so flattering this whole style like this and you can wear a nice scarf it's very heavy beautiful beautifully made this one is the same price as the other coat so next I see a sweater it's like a brown little knit sweater Sweater. It reminds me a lot of the 90s. It has like a long collar. It hits just at my hips. And the buttons are Scottish thistles. Mm. Mm -mm. <sighs> okay, here is the sweater. I have the other sweater underneath it, so it looks a little weird. But I like it. It's really pretty. It feels like something Claire would wear. But like modernized. That's what I love about this. I love the modernized like Outlander collection. I'm getting hot. You know, it's like 9 degrees outside. I'm like putting on sweaters and peacoats. Is it raining? 
Whoa. Mom, it's raining. <gasps> I have a skirt. This is the Mackenzie tartan because there's no color in it. This looks to be like a midi skirt. It's going to go like right on my knees up to my waist. This is awesome. I love this skirt. They have a smaller version of this. Not sure if it's still available, but I got to wear it at Comic-Con. Here's the first skirt that they made. Here's the second one. It's a lot longer and you can see how the Mackenzie tartan differs from the Fraser tartan. Wait, Fraser tartan differs from, no, Mackenzie, no. Fraser tartan differs from the Mackenzie tartan. Definitely wearing this with some tights. How did I get these in here? Very flimsy boxes. Okay, so I just like totally ruined the box. Okay, it's like now like pouring outside, so this is very weird for California. Sorry if you hear that. Ah. Ooh. <gasps> what? Holy, holy, holy crap. This is the red dress. This is the, the red dress. This is the red dress. Oh my god. Gosh, this is the red dress. <laughs> I am so excited to put this on. Look at it. It's a shortened version, obviously. You don't want all those petticoats underneath. They have the red dress that you can buy in modern wear. This is so pretty, so perfect for the holidays. I'm gonna wear it out on the town when I go to pubs in Scotland. Look, the red dress. I think I might need a size smaller, but I think it still works. The fabric is movable so I can move my arms. Like if I lift my arms a little bit, it just come up. That is my favorite thing so far, I think. What's this? <gasps> what is this? This is so pretty. It's a, like a kimono. Oh, this her reminds me of what she wears when she's like preggers. It's so pretty. The kimono is very long. It's got some like puffy sleeve action happening. Some pleated detail on the side. This is $64.90. We have a shirt. It says Sass Knock on it. It's pretty purple flowers around. Ooh, what's this? This is like a different kind of tartan. Oh, this looks like a 1940s dress. This is a sundress. It's kind of like a teal, purple, brown, tartany plaid. Very muted colors. Very clear, like Scotland 1940s, 1950s. This like gathering detail on the bust right here is very like 1940s. And we just have a few more things and then this is it. I think this is the entire collection. And we have this it looks like a like a chemise something that Claire would be wearing to sleep kind of like on the wedding night <laughs> it's got like an underslip and then like the white it has sassanok embroidered here on the bottom of the dress then the sleeves have some lace detail a drawstring through it and so does the top this is the last item this Looks like a sweater. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's like a sweater dress. It's a dark green sweater dress with a thistle and crown button detail again. It has a fold over neckline, long sleeves that are ribbed on the end, and it goes to about my knee. This is very pretty, very like wintry like, very Christmassy. Very excited to wear this with some boots and some tights in Scotland. It's gonna look so fashion. So that was it. That was the whole Outlander collection. I'm gonna try to pick it all up. This is the entire Outlander collection. It is huge. I am so thankful. I have so many new clothes to wear. Thank you so much to Torrid for sending this to me. This is not sponsored, by the way. If you want to see me in these outfits, I'll be posting pictures on my Instagram, which is Toshopolis. This is the new Outlander collection on Torrid. If you guys want to check it out, they still do have some things available from their first collection, but it's very slim. Like, they definitely don't have this sweater anymore. Thank you all so much for watching. I'm Natasha. If you guys want to keep up with my adventures, definitely make sure to check out my Instagram. Sasha and I will have a meetup in Scotland in Edinburgh. We don't know which day yet because we don't have our itinerary. I will also be at New York Comic Con on Thursday. Me, Sasha, Jesse, Kat, and Christine are all having a panel that Thursday at the convention and we should be there the whole time but that's like the event that you guys can meet us at. I'll see you guys all in the future. I make videos every Thursday. Keep calm and fangirl on. Bye!